All right, now let's see who's up next on this countdown. Ha! Yay! I hate everything. No, I mean the channel I hate everything. No, but put that away. That's for a different video. The channel I hate everything is known for making videos hating on, well, anything or everything. I mean, it's plain obvious judging from his name. I'll call him IHE for now, considering it may get weird later on calling him I hate everything. But IHE's main series is I hate, where he picks a topic and rants about it for, I don't know, about 20 years maybe? Can you even imagine what trailers are going to be like in the future? Bwah, they came from outer space. Bwah, bwah, bwah. Give us your money, China. Bwah, bwah, bwah. Give us your money, dumbasses. Bwah, bwah, bwah. Transformers 17, the revenge of the war of the kingdom of the crystal skull of the attack of the dark side of the rebellion and the revelation of the, you'll give us your money anyway, fuck you. He also has a ton of other series, but I'll get to them in a bit. The consistent quality of his videos have always been great, and there's rarely ever a bad IHE video. If not, there's probably not even a bad IHE video besides his old videos. I remember back in 2015 when I found out about his channel towards the whole reaction videos drama, and I was like, wow, this guy's really interesting. Let's see what other videos he has on his channel. Heck, I even remember when he was one of the YouTubers that I made a spoof on last year on my Thunder Spoofs week. Remember like seven months ago when this video called I hate reaction videos was made? Well, I kind of have a confession to make about prank channels. Granted, it wasn't the best spoof in any way, and it was also horrible now looking back, but that's just to show how long I've known about this YouTuber's existence. Even though he doesn't know I exist. Notice me, Poppy! He also is part of the podcast called The Jarcast, where he hangs out with a group of his friends and they just talk about stuff. <laughs> Wanna make a Alex, your voice is broken by then. Wanna make a Minecraft machine? And we were all like, yeah! <laughs> In fact, that's what I'm listening to right now uh, while I'm making this video. Now don't worry, he doesn't just have a series where he just hates stuff because God knows what the human race is capable of. But he also has a few other series on his channel. He has an I Love series, ironically, which he's only picked one topic about what he loves. Look, I've done my research, I've read why people like it, I've read why people don't. And then using that information, I've come to my own conclusion, and my conclusion is that I fucking like it. He also has another series called The Search for the Worst, where he picks out a movie and he critiques and bashes the movie into pieces. Uh, but my point is, how these companies are allowed to get away with this level of counterfeiting is, is flooring to me. Especially when they have the fucking balls to go up against one of the most powerful companies on the planet. Disney. Once he's done tearing a movie apart, he then makes a commentary slash reaction video to the movie and edits it together in a way where it's funny and entertaining at the same time. See, this is interesting because the first movie was so bare bones it was hard to well, even so say much anything. Like shit going on. But this has the opposite problem where <laughs> so yeah. much shit is going on. You like. Mm -hmm. But then again, if you don't like the idea of him bashing things, then he also has another series called The Quest for the Best, where he picks out movies that he thinks are great and talks about the movies. It's a similar story here. It's a group of people that are on their way to a planet. Things happen, aliens get involved. You you can see where this is going. And, and the simplicity of that plot does make it sound very alluring. It makes it sound interesting. A couple of my favorite IHE videos are I Hate School and I Hate Movie Slash Game Trailers. Mainly because of how he brings out his points in a very funny and random way. I honestly don't know how it's random, but usually humor like IHE can make me laugh and think to myself, Wow. HA! But in all honesty, I still continue to watch his videos as much as possible. I just haven't been watching his videos recently because of how I have this piece of shit project in the way. Actually, kind of think of it, I haven't really been watching much of my favorite YouTubers as much because of this project. Shit!